assalam alaikum students in our previous video we have already discussed about or we have already got introduced to the chapter crop production and management right we have also seen the definition of crop there wherein we know that if the same kind of plant same kind of uh, uh, any kind of plant is grown on a large area right then we are calling that production that way of producing the plant as crop next thing that we have discussed was temperature humidity and rainfall these are the three factors or uh, that is these are the three climatic conditions that will decide the type of crop that will be grown in an area so depending upon this today in our today's video we will continue what type of crops can be grown in a particular area depending upon these factors that is nothing but temperature humidity and rainfall let's see what are those so here crops whatever the plants that we are growing on the large scale right crops have been classified or uh, categorized into two main patterns that is kharif crops and rabi crops let's see one by one what are these kharif crops are nothing but the crops that are grown in rainy season particularly in rainy season the crops will be grown here why is it so because the crops that are included under this category they require large quantity of water what do they need they require large quantity of water and that kind of supply is possible in rainy season in india rainy season uh, is or you can say it is generally observed from june to september right from june to september kharif crops will be grown in india and these crops include paddy maize i hope you all are aware about the names of these crops in hindi or urdu soya bean groundnut and cotton these crops require large quantity of water hence they are grown in rainy season which in india is generally from june to september and these are named as as kharif crops next we have rabi crops here these crops are grown in winter season you can uh, just guess that these crops unlike kharif crops require less amount of water less amount or quantity of water is required by these crops or plants since winter season is considered which is generally from october to march in india see we are uh, saying these seasons the months based on indian climate right so here uh, rabi crops which are grown in winter season they require less amount of water and are usually grown uh, during the time period of october to march and the crops that are included here are wheat gram pea mustard linseed and sometimes sometimes students pulses and vegetables are also grown during this time period right so today we have seen here depending upon the temperature humidity and rainfall or you can say depending upon the climate of an area the crops have been classified into two categories kharif crops rabi crops kharif crops are usually grown in rainy season as they require large quantity of water since rainy season is considered it is usually from june to september and the crops that are included here are paddy maize soya bean groundnut and cotton unlike kharif crops rabi crops are grown in winter season they require less amount of water and are usually grown 
from october to march they include wheat gram pea mustard linseed pulses and vegetables right so these are the two categories or the two patterns that are being followed in agricultural practices for maintaining the soil fertility to utilize the resources properly and giving time to natural resources to get replenished right it is the most suitable form or suitable way to grow the crops